Hey everybody, it's Buddy. You ain't gonna believe where I'm at. I'm at Pensmore. I wanted to come and talk to Steve about the eclipse, but he left. They said he left Sunday. Kinda wish I'd have talked to him uh, Friday. I, I started to come out here Friday, but I didn't. Okay, everybody, this is Buddy. I got three hoes. One of them's not really round. One of them's really round. Looks pretty good. In 1978, the last eclipse, if I got that date right, uh, this is how I watched it, and this is how I'm going to watch it now. But if you can see where I'm at, we will be able to hopefully see it here and you can you'll be able to actually see it go right over that almost perfect hole right there and we'll try all of them when it's time not yet it's not time yet but it's getting close Look at that pretty thing right there. Hardly no winds blowing. That's a wind bang. Barely see it, barely make it out. Now you can see it a little better. I remember when they put that up there. I actually got a picture of it on the ground. It's huge. It doesn't look huge, but it is. All right. Oh, the wind blew it. All right, by my watch, we're getting really close. But look, we are not in the totality. This is uh, near Springfield, Missouri, Ozark. And this is Pensmore. So we're not gonna maybe see what I'm thinking we're gonna see, but still I was hoping Steve was here zoom in on that circle see what we see nothing yet people drove thousands of miles to get to the where it's totally actually you know total eclipse I drove 11 miles I still don't see no partial not yet come on zoom in Nothing. Nothing. I've got nothing. Well, I still got nothing. I can tell that it's not as bright as it once was. But nope. Can't really tell it yet. Nothing. I was hoping we can see it. Whoa, I'm off my hole.
Well, it didn't turn out to be anything like where you could actually see the sun, the moon cross it. I, I had it, I was watching it time-wise, but nothing. It was pretty dry. <laughs> it was, I'm glad I didn't have to drive too far to even witness that little bit of it. But it was not, it was not what I thought it was going to be. But I did get a chance to see uh, the update right here. They got that looking good, and that's where they are right now. They've started a little bit on that side over there, on the other side of the, the red rig. But, all right, maybe later we'll get, we'll get some more footage of it. Well, well. <laughs> the solar eclipse in this part of Missouri even pins more as a backdrop. Didn't work out. <laughs> I thought maybe it would, but um, yeah, we're just too far south. But, hey, I tried. The uh, main entryway, they're gonna have a building here that's gonna actually be a gift shop and it's it's still a process it ain't it, it the foundation work is in but it's not it's not ready all right let me get through the gate okay you can see the signs on the gate authorized personnel only so just cause you seen buddy huggins come up in here don't think anybody can do that because that ain't the truth. You've got to be invited, and uh, you got to have a purpose. So, <laughs> disclaimer: don't go beyond this point right here at Pensmore unless you've uh, been invited, got an invitation, or you've got a purpose. So, this is—I'm fortunate. I'm blessed. This is my. I believe 11th or 12th time out here and hopefully I'll be able to get more updates. Steve will give me permission. I want to do that solar panel. It's beautiful uh, the way they've got it hooked up. It's it's huge array, 100 and, 192 or 94, 194 solar panels, high density solar panels. And um, the arrangement of the battery bank is just... Uh, I just can't wait to get that video. And of course, I want to talk to him more in detail about the uh, Liberty Tree. I noticed he's got more plantings around the, the compound. So that'll be good. And the hydro geothermal room. Uh, couldn't show you no videos on that today, but um, one day he'll give me permission, hopefully. And I, we can go into detail about how that works. For the guest house, we've got that video show, but for the main house, it's like, oh my God, like 10 times as big for the guest house, bigger with volume and amount of uh, cooling and heating of water that can be done. So hopefully I'll get that. Keep checking back. Please like us and share with your social media. Please subscribe and click the bell to be notified of our new videos. Stay tuned. This video is Creative Commons. You have permission to download, copy, and distribute it by any means. What would you say about your 20s? Was it good? Was it bad? Was it somewhere in between? How would you look back on that, that decade in your um, life? I don't really like you, Luke, so I'm not going to answer your question. All right.